So I got a new computer, and one thing you might be asking me right now is, how good is this new computer that you are actually talking about? <laughs> well, uh... Also, if you want to know the specs of the computer, it's on the screen right now, and it's in the description, so you can check that. And also, we got a sponsor for this video. Wait, what's the sponsor? My ad revenue? Yeah, from buying this computer, I am a little in debt, so if you would hit the like button, I would really appreciate it, because that'll boost the video. But <laughs> yeah, enjoy the video. So yeah, I got a new computer, and I am running Roblox with shaders. It looks horrible right now, but this is because I'm zoomed out. But when you zoom in, you start to see all the reflections, all the little details, everything about the map. And it looks really cool during day and during night, and I think the snow is just awesome for this. Because you can see little reflections on things, and you can see shadows. It's like Roblox ray tracing, which is pretty cool. But yeah, so you can see like the shine on this. You can see a person realistically drive off the side of Pizza Planet. Yeah, there's also crazy shadows on this. And if you want to see what it looks like now, this is what it looks like. And then if I turn it off, yeah, so it makes a pretty big difference. Adds a lot more fog, adds depth. So like if I look at myself, this is how it looks when I'm normally looking at myself. And then when I turn the shaders on, it adds depth. It's supposed to be wherever I look with my mouse, it'll follow that with the depth. I don't know if it doesn't much. It's kind of glitchy right now, but it's slowly getting better. But yeah, so I'm going to show you as much good stuff as I can during the day. And then when it turns night in this map, I will show you how much cooler it looks because on the nightclub and everything, all these, you can see the glow where it like glows back at you. You can kind of see on the edges how there's little glowing rings, kind of reflections, which is pretty cool. Also, if you want to see a really realistic Santa, oh, that looks cool. Look at how cool that is. Like it's him and then there's shade in the background. Shade. Shadow. No, not shadows either. It's uh blur. There's also a creepy... <laughs> Uh, <laughs> yes, when you look at stuff, it shows it, and then you can see the city hall in the background all blurred. It looks really nice. There's also a really cool Christmas tree, and you can see the shadows coming off the side. Some of these are Roblox features. Ah! But yeah, I think it looks awesome. You get really realistic shaders. You get reflections on the ground, and it just makes Roblox look nicer in general. Now, yeah, you need a pretty crazy computer to run this smooth. Right now, I am running it at, like, 100 fps and here it kind of looks bad it looks all right there's a little bit of shade on oh okay actually it does look a lot better if you look at it like this, this is without and this is with yeah i changed my mind you have to turn it off and on to realize how much better it actually is it's so like this is with it off and then this is with it on it just makes everything look so much cleaner oh do you see it Look, it like shows the fence and then it blurs the background. That's awesome. So we got the really realistic hair salon. We got all the people in the line waiting. This is definitely not social distance di dis distancing. I need to go back to school. So let's actually work here. How do you work here? Oh, you have to go to those. You want... What kind of hair is that? Are you kidding? Pink hair? Okay. You know what? This hair looks better on you. Let's give you... Let's give you red hair. Get out of here. <laughs> I ruined her hairstyle. But yeah, it is starting to turn nighttime. So I am about to show you the really cool part of these shaders. So as you can see right here, it really, really gets shadowy quality. I know nobody's going to be looking like this in real life unless they have like oil on them or something. But also you can see that little reflection of Pizza Planet down in the road, which just makes it really realistic. Also, if you look up at the light you can see the screen start to get brighter and you can see the little effects on the side of the screen pretty much all this other stuff here is boring i just want to show you the nightclub if you see that really quick you just see the glow and you see the glow on the ground and it's just awesome here's it from the front this shader works best with neon stuff 
as you can see it's like the reflections are crazy you can see all the particles and you can see snow the snow is no different but this looks really awesome and if i stand in front of it but right here you can see the nightclub it just <laughs> it looks awesome and if you go on the inside it's incredibly shadowy so much ray tracing and also since i am back up i am able to demonstrate my uh my human cooker so when people jump in they start to fling themselves around every time they jump but yes when you get in you you can't really get out i don't want to see my people in here I, I can just close the blinds and let it cook and then when you open it back up you can check if they're cooked or not i'll show a little demonstration on the screen right now Oh my god, I cooked it too long. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I have not posted in a little while. Again, I'm just getting really off schedule. I don't know what to do. <laughs> I'm thinking of video ideas. I'll try and get back into the swing of things, but hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to go down and like and subscribe. Also, all of my socials are down in the description too, and they are on the screen if you want to look at them. That's it for the video. I hope you guys enjoyed. <coughs> Bye, guys.